uh, a slightly new uh, apparatus for our community. Um, it is displacing the uh, 1993-75 foot aerial ladder we have today, uh, which we will retain and refurbish and keep in service for 10 or 15 years. But this truck, at 100 feet of height, will handle our six-story buildings that are coming into our community, whether it's Burwick or uh, the hospital at 80 feet or uh, other structures that are in the planning stages. This allows us to access both four-story walk-ups that are well set back from the roadway with uh, things in our way so we can get close to them, and our six-story buildings that are uh, just taller than we're able to get to with the 75 that we have today. It also has, um, though we have the same water capacity uh, concepts on our present ladder, it can move a lot more water and do it in two different monitors at once, that allowing us to both protect an existing building adjacent that's being exposed by the fire and also fight fire uh, with the same device, which is very helpful. Um, what you're witnessing right now is called acceptance testing. We're proving the truck can do all the things it's stated to do, and right now we're proving the aerial waterway can flow the uh, required flows and pressures uh, as it was manufactured. So we're testing it here where we have a decent, a good water supply, um, and moving the water into the ocean as a, as a way to manage that much water. Um, as part of this day, we have to uh, do all kinds of weight balance checks, driving checks, uh, and just helping 